All right, and we are back. So, as of this recording, the stream, EA has announced that there will be no single-player DLC for Mass Effect Andromeda. We kind of knew this was coming, but it's still a bummer that this happened. I was actually looking forward to having some DLC to play down the road for this and stream that and revisit the game once that had come out. But this is sadly not the case. So... Having done a stream of Mass Effect 3, it is kind of melancholic. I've done a Let's Play of, of Mass Effect 3. It is kind of melancholic because this is probably going to be the last Mass Effect game. So, anyway. We have, we had, last time, activated the vault. And so now, hopefully, Hidara will be a little less toxic. We still have side quests to work on. We have a memory trigger over there, which I think is like one of the last memory triggers in the game. Um, we'll be able to put our out set up our outpost over here once we finish dealing with some other crap. We have an Engarn relic over here. We have two side quests over here. One of these is directly related to, to completing our narrative side quests. Another one is. Just other narrative side quests, but the main Kadara mission uh, missions, and then this one is just general side quest. Party is um, Vetra and Liam. Vetra has completed her loyalty mission, so I can actually max out some of her skills. I have a bunch of anti-shield stuff already, so I'm going to mark this as anti-armor because we need some actual anti-armor stuff. Trooper charge is already maxed. I like, um, I think maybe I just want to go for a turbo armor as opposed to explosive purge is because turbo armor helps make Vetra a more of a combat person because Vetra is definitely a ranged person as opposed to Liam who could, tends to get in the thick of things. I need five points for either of those two skills. Liam, I haven't put his loyalty missions yet, so I can't do his stuff. Um, so let's go with this loadout for now. Party. up. Those exiles won't be on our side. Yep, yes we have. Fly cache here, and then we have two roads going into the mountains. We do side quest over there, so let's take that one that route. Back up and around. 
The exiles have quite a setup over there. Won't be happy to see us. I am hearing a lot of gunfire. I passed my turn off. What was with that fight back there? It's cool flanking. Their shields were drained. Their ship. Get hit. They train. That's what they're for. Risky. Irresponsible. Yeah, I'm gonna take a lecture on responsibility. Hey. What's that supposed to mean? Just keep your judgment to yourself, unless you want the same. Him. Nice, there we go. And that you should get better enough points to level up again. And smuggler. Damage or power damage. Let's go for power damage. She's got a whole bunch of, of uh, offensive powers. Like this one. It's English damage when in cover or not in cover. Well, there's everybody. Let's get back in the car and continue on our way. Random nomad roadblock. Uh, I would probably do better by crafting one. Hey, mineral resources and I know there's an arms cache task. Trucking. How many other ships like the Tempest are stashed away somewhere? Not a lot. A few toys for rainy days. How much rainier can it get? Keep that thought. Weird buffering again. I feel like we're doing much patching on the single player side of things, which is a bummer, also. Because that'd be nice to have some patching for that buffering issue there. Are you all tripping balls? It wasn't that violent. What's happening here? Who are you? Is this your data pad? Are you one of them? 
Easy. Whatever's going on, I'm not part of it. We'll see. Everyone's acting crazy, spouting all that nonsense. I can't remember how it started. I'm not even sure how I got here. What do you mean? Nobody's in their right mind. And there are these people, others. They showed up and they left this data pad. Ugh. Ugh. You feeling all right? Terrible migraines. They strike without warning. I think it's them. I heard one of them say, we left the data pad behind. Ugh. I'm... I'm fine now. I'm sorry to trouble you. There was nothing. Be seeing you. Be seeing you? Normally, that would be... I'd be completely innocuous. Except... Yeah. Genocide is the intentional destruction of a given population. So this is Cerberus. So this screams Cerberus assholes. They exhibit unusual brain activity. An outside signal is affecting their thought process. What can we do for them? Nothing immediate. Though if you scan others, I may be able to locate the source of the signal. Let's find these clowns. That responsibility thing. It's about my sister, isn't it? Good sleuthing, Sherlock. Gold star. Your mouth's gonna get your ass in trouble. My mouth didn't drag a kid to Andromeda. Screw you, Costa. She had a choice. Some choice. Lose you or come here. Crazy how upbeat she is, considering. Stay out of my shit and don't talk to my sister. Wow, um, that was a really, really bad choice of party members. Get together. Oh, we shoot some space dinosaurs instead. Looks like center mass, not the head, is the weak spot. Who wants to bet that there's some Cer Cerberus assholes who come to the Andromeda Galaxy? You're not supposed to be in here? Alright, give me a moment. Now with the dinosaur out of the way, let's try this dialogue again. What the hell are you doing to those people out there? It's an experiment. Physically, no harm has come to them. They're fine. You guys have to be Cerberus. Cerberus. You're doing all this on purpose? Are you insane? We've been called worse back home. We used to work oh, for an yep. organization called Cerberus. Until our boss decided he'd rather spend money on truly crazy ideas like bringing back people from the dead. <laughs> Project Lazarus. Pure voodoo. But in Andromeda, we're our own masters. And what you saw out there, it's the birth of something Project amazing. Lazarus, by the way, for those who forget, is what brought back... A host back... of minds all linked oh, together. Connected. We're harnessing the power of consciousness to create a new kind of supercomputer. So, um... Project Lazarus, by the way, for those who haven't played Mass Effect 2 in a while or forgotten, that's what brought back um, Shepard. What is Cerberus about? Purity. 
We think humanity should chart its own course, free of alien laws or the morality designed to hold us back. Our boss was straying from the path, lost his focus. He and that Lawson woman were recruiting all the wrong people. Friends but what do you mean places. the party from the last game? Andromeda is a chance for a do-over. Humanity should call the shots here. The rest can follow our lead. Funny. I met a woman named Catherine Nye. She was fighting against the sort of thing you're doing here. We know about her. She got caught up in the Cerberus project back home. Overlord. Gavin Archer and that bunch. Good idea. Poor execution. This will be different. Um... Oh. Uh, okay. Uh, maybe I shouldn't have killed the monsters out there. Maybe we should have, like fed you to them. Um. What are you doing on Kadara? The Badlands is a perfect place to do the work that needs to be done. Must be done. Against all these new threats in Andromeda, it's vital we find an edge for humanity. What do you exactly think you were doing here? What exactly is this experiment doing to those people out there? The right energy focused at the right frequency can entrain a person's consciousness. The mind is ultimately just electromagnetic patterns. You mean mind control? Those people were banished. They're criminals. They were using their minds to make trouble anyway. We thought we'd make better use. And now, by linking them together, they're like a living computer, but working at the speed of thought. Similar to the computer you've got in your head. Enough of this, Sam. I've located the control for the signal. It will shut it down. down. We can't stop you, but those people depend on the signal now. Their minds need it to function. Leave them be. How do we shut this experiment down, Sam? I can tune the signal against the scientists as punishment, freeing the people. The victims will likely suffer complications as a result. Or I can alter the nature of the signal to ease the victim's predicament, unlock the system from further changes. Or I could just walk away and do nothing. You know... <sighs> hmm... So, what I'd actually like to do is lock the si is ease the victim's predicament, ease their symptoms as best I can using the system, lock it so the scientists can't change it, and then deal with the scientists so they can't start up their the, the scientists is such a wrong worm for these ass, how, ass clowns. Deal with the Cerberus maroons so they can't start this crap again. Normally, the just the way these just desserts worked back in the Milky Way galaxy was their science was their experiments would turn on them, kill them horribly, and then Shepard and company would clean up the mess. I guess the best we could say is we can at least get the resolve this before the excessive bloodshed. Change the signal. Try to make things easier on those people. You ruined it. Those people are no good to us now. Glad I could help. Now go back and crawl under the rock you came from. Apparently, I can't, like, pistol whip you. Alright. Let's... All right, let's do... Critical hits. Oh, there's an option to feed you jackass, feed those jerks to the critters. So the rest of the people with families here, 
You're judging them too? Look, I get it. The initiative sold off some golden worlds. But kids, even if everything was perfect, it's 600 years and no going back. A child doesn't understand that. I get you too, Costa. Everyone knows how to parent other people's kids. Get back to me when you're looking out for something other than yourself. That's it. While they're occupied, let's say hello. And then there's the Tyrannosauruses. That's that. There's any ammo refills here. Not a badly designed, um, like, environment. In terms of, like, the habitat. If I have a complaint, is you've had, like, a sink area, but you have no, um, lavatory. by something nearby. Yep, I see the, oh, see the gate over there. I think I found something. Looks like a wire. Miscellaneous debris.
So apparently its weak spot is its backside. Get, the, get some lithium first. Here goes nothing. Huh. Did it work? Only one way to find out. a data pad with what looks like a nav point. Must be where Zia's hiding the cargo. Probably left that behind for the buyer. Whatever happened to just going to a store? <laughs> Sloan takes a cut from all official sales. Aha! Uh -huh. Gotta get creative if you want to go around that. Did you find anything on your end? The Salarian is a fence. No direct connection to the collective. My guess is Zia met him to find potential buyers. Let's follow up on those coordinates. I'll meet you there. All right. We over here. Let's put that on hold for a second and finish up this quest. Automated protocols activated. Deploying forward station. Mining zones have been added to your nav system, Pathfinder. Thank you. of outposts out here. It looks like that's it right there. Not the most structurally sound settlement I've seen. Like this whole setup kind of screams, but like I should say is if there's a geographic geological instability underneath this thing or in this area, and there's basically an earthquake happens, or there's significant erosion, you're kind of out of luck. I like talk to you or something? Apparently not. Another settlement over there, or dwelling. Try that one. There 
it is. Last known location of this Johan guy. Hopefully Remy's inside and alive. Maybe they're not as bad as the warden made them out to be. Not holding my breath. All right. Go on. Well, that pretty much settles that. They are just coming out of the woodwork. Looks like outlaws. Uh, no, no, duh. Okay, that, that's... You are really annoying. They got a sharpshooter. Behind cover, you get shot. Go ahead. through most of my sniper hey, rifle ammo, so Remy. let's... Hopefully she's... Yeah. So many more big fights here. Force feedback vibration on my from the slums said we'd be safe I'm the only one left you're safe now it's over no it's not I I'm still stuck in the Badlands even though I paid my protection fee I know the outcast who wrongly kicked you out of Kadara port he sent me are they going to let me back in at the very least Grayson I found Remy we need a pickup thank God I'll send a shuttle right away Thank you so much. Thank you. Okay, woof. So this is not good at all.
So, um, that was the Kadara Omnitool Massacre. Supercharge is already maxed. I like, um, I think maybe I just want to go for a turbo armor as opposed to explosive purge is because turbo armor helps make Vetro a middle of a combat person because Vetro is definitely a ranged person as opposed to Liam who can, tends to get in the thick of things. I need five points for either of those two skills. Liam, I haven't put his loyalty missions yet, so I can't do his stuff. Um, so let's go with this loadout for now. Party. Alright, and we are back. So, as of this recording, the stream, EA has announced that there will be no single-player DLC for Mass Effect Andromeda. We kind of knew this was coming, but it's still a bummer that this happened. I was actually looking forward to having some DLC to play down the road for this and stream that and revisit the game once that had come out. But this is sadly not the case. So... Having done a stream of Mass Effect 3, it is kind of melancholic. I've done a Let's Play of, of Mass Effect 3. It is kind of melancholic because this is probably going to be the last Mass Effect game. So, anyway. We have, we had last time, activated the vault. And so now, hopefully, Hidara will be a little less toxic. We still have side quests to work on. We have a memory trigger over there, which I think is like one of the last memory triggers in the game. Um, we'll be able to put our out set up our outpost over here once we finish dealing with some other crap. We have an Engarn relic over here. We have two side quests over here. One of these is directly related to, to completing our narrative side quests. Another one is. Just other narrative side quests, but the main Kadara mission uh, missions, and then this one is just general side quest. Party is um, Vetra and Liam. Vetra has completed her loyalty mission, so I can actually max out some of her skills. I have a bunch of anti-shield stuff already, so I'm going to mark this as anti-armor because we need some actual anti-armor stuff. What was with that fight back there? It's called cool flanking. Their shields were drained. Their ship. Get hit, they drain. That's what they're for. Risky, irresponsible. Yeah, I'm gonna take a lecture on responsibility. Hey! What's that supposed to mean? Just keep your judgment to yourself, unless you want the same. Damn.
Alright. Nice, there we go. And that you should get better enough points to level up again. And smuggler. Damage or power damage? Let's go for power damage. It's just got a whole bunch of... Heads up. Those exiles won't be on our side. Yep. Yes, we have. Fly cache here, and then we have two roads going into the mountains. We have a side quest over there, so let's take that one, that route. Back up and around. The exiles have quite a setup over there. Won't be happy to see us. I am hearing a lot of gunfire. I passed my turn off. <laughs> 